A South Tampa woman knows exactly what it's like to make the voyage to the wreckage of the Titanic. Michelle Turman made the dive twice, the youngest woman at the time to do so. Today, we visited with her as she shared her experiences. Here's a picture of me. It's a black and white. This was Michelle Turman at 27, the curator of collections for the RMS Titanic. In 2000, she made the expedition nearly two and a half miles beneath the ocean's surface. I would tell you that after I did it, I would absolutely do it again. Even in light of what's happening now, I, I probably would still do it. Turman and two others were in the submersible, a different vessel than the one operated by OceanGate. The types of subs that we worked on um, were tested by the military. They were research vessels where we were actually extracting artifacts from the bottom of the ocean floor. But she says the same concerns existed. Oxygen, temperatures, the weather and timing. Uh, the ideal time to go is really end of July, August. So it's interesting to me why they're out there now. She also understands what the families of those on board must be feeling. She says her family had the same worries. She was ready to take the risk. She knew the potential costs and what, as an explorer and researcher, she could offer to history. It's a feeling that I'll never forget. It is overwhelming. It's humbling. It is something that is truly life changing. Uh, you have a respect, a respect for those who perished, a respect for those families, a respect for history. And she also wrote a book about taking risks in life. It's called Jumping the Queue, in which she has a chapter dedicated to her experiences diving the Titanic, the rewards, and of course, the risks.